And then Andy says, Mr. Deacon, you want your sons to go to Harvard or Yale? He didn't say that. God is my witness. And Deacon, <laughs> Deacon just blinked for a second. And then he laughed himself silly. And afterwards, he actually shook Andy's hand. My ass. Shook his hand. Hey, I, <laughs> I near soiled myself. <laughs> All Andy needed was a suit and a tie and a little jiggly hula gal on his desk. He would have been Mr. Dufresne, if you please. Making a few friends, huh, Andy? I wouldn't say friends. I'm a convicted murderer who provides sound financial plan. It's a wonderful pet to have. Got you out of the laundry, though, didn't it? Well, it might do more than that. How about expanding the library, get some new books in there? I'm gonna ask for something, ask for a pool table. Right. How do you expect to do that? I'm getting new books in here, Mr. Dufresne, if you please. Ask the warden for fun. <laughs> son, 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 the six wardens have been through here in my tenure, and I've learned one immutable, universal truth. Not one of them born. One whose asshole wouldn't pucker up tighter than a snare drum when you ask him for funds. The budget's stretched thin as it is. I see. Perhaps I could write the state senate and request funds directly from them. As far as they're concerned, only three ways to spend the taxpayers' hard-earned when it comes to prisons. More walls, more bars, more guards. Still, I'd, I'd like to try, with your permission. I'll write a letter a week. They can't ignore me forever. Sure can. But you write your letters if it makes you happy. I'll even mail them for you. How's that? So Andy started writing a letter a week, just like he said. And, just like Norton said, Andy got no answers. The following April, Andy did tax returns for half the guards at Shawshank. Year after that, he did them all, including the wardens. Year after that, they rescheduled the start of the intramural season to coincide with tax season. The guards on the opposing teams all remembered to bring their W-2s. So, Moresby Prison issued you your gun, but you actually had to pay for it. Damn right, the holster too. See, that's tax deductible. You can write that off. Yes, sir. Andy was a regular cottage industry. In fact, it got so busy at tax time, he was allowed a staff. Hey, Red, can you hand me a stack of 1040s? Got me out of the wood shop a month out of the year, and that was fine by me. And still, he kept sending those letters. 